They're burning brush today to prevent far forest fires this spring. The State Forest Fire Service is conducting so-called prescribed burns in parts of the Pinelands this winter. Environment correspondent Ed Rogers has the story. State forest fire crews were setting small blazes in the Greenwood Forest Wildlife Management Area today. These fires are set to consume ground fuels that feed larger blazes. It's pine needles, it could be leaf litter, it could be grass, and uh, those uh, fine fuels, we call them, are where fires start along the ground, and then the fires move up through the shrubs and into the trees ultimately, and that's when they become wildfires. The controlled burns won't totally eliminate the chance of a fire in this area again, but a blaze would have less fuel and be less intense. Water truck crews stand by to prevent the fires from jumping roads and reaching areas that aren't targeted. The Forest Fire Service uses helicopters to monitor the fire, but also to drop small pellets to start fires in parts of the Pinelands that aren't accessible. It's very dense, very hard to get through uh, by walking and um, mechanically. So if we can do that with the helicopter by dropping fire pellets into the remote locations, then we can start the fires and it's more economical and we can treat larger areas that way. The mild dry winter we've been experiencing has been an advantage to the Forest Fire Service in conducting these burns. All the prescribed burning that we do, as you saw today, is weather dependent. We had some sleet and some snow today in the middle of the day that wasn't predicted. Uh, so it's definitely weather dependent. We have a small window. The Forest Fire Service says it hopes to conduct the prescribed burns over 20,000 acres before March 15th. So far, they've treated half that area statewide. Ed Rogers, NJN News, Woodland Township, Burlington County.